Okay, show her the book. We can use my credit card. I think Gabriel spent all five minutes playing around in Gridersburg. Five minutes! That's all he used. Okay, can't skip this. Have to wait for Mark Hamill, the truck driver, to tell you that he's just gonna stay here and wait for you. By the way, how did Gabriel get the money to... Oh yeah, that's right, he just borrowed it off the credit card. He doesn't have a PIN number. How can he borrow against the credit line if he doesn't have a PIN number? Okay. So about the double snake ring, or the double snake mound in Africa. We're gonna go backwards. So you start from number six and you grab all the tiles and starting from number one the number eleven that's how you place that's how you place the uh, snake tiles and if you do it this way then it's actually much shorter so twelve you can't remove twelve is fixed uh, again I screw up here because I can't see the actual tiles so I lose about ten seconds by correcting my mistake I realized that that particular one I put 10 back then I realized I accidentally put 9 in that one see I definitely screwed up so I lose quite a few seconds there so already there's about two to two and a half minutes of improvement that I can make but again I'm lazy. This is this is why this is why my times were obsoleted on TAS. I may do them again. I mean, this is sort of an unfinished project, something that I like to do for fun. Okay, we're on number nine. Grab the two tiles. Dump in number eight, which is the swirly thingy. Number seven, door is already there. So put in number six. Boy, this is boring. This is really boring. Now I know what the DVD commentators feel like when they do those DVD commentaries of the television shows talk for 40 minutes. No wonder they don't do it for every episode. It's like, oh god, how can you? Anyway, let's see here. Okay, so at three, we go back down to two, and after we put in number two, we go back to number three. So this is the fastest way around. You only need to make one and a half trips around the ring in order to get everything in the, same, in the place and get back so the zombies are floating. It's not because of the CPU cycles, it's actually because you exit the first room with the zombie too quickly and it doesn't allow the zombies to start turning. They'll turn in this room regardless, but it actually makes the uh, the the room with the zombie in front of the door much easier if they're still turning. How nice of the zombies not to follow. Wheel within a wheel. Wheel within a wheel. Wheel within a wheel. Okay, you have to look at the trough. You can look at it again, which gets you more points. But looking at the trough will indicate that there are holes. Once you do that, then you can take both iron bars. You don't have to try to lift it, because Wolfgang is a very slow walker. And now operate the table.
dagger on the monster. And then skip the oh-so-hard scene. Back to Gracie in New Orleans. She gets a kidnapped. Oh no! Day 10. So now we're almost finished. Aren't you glad? Okay, we need to head back to the bookstore. The thing about the bookstore, you do not need to read Malia's letter. In order to trigger Mosley, you just need to approach the door. The curtain's in the back. When you talk to them, you don't have to fill them in on anything. You just need to make a plan. Go make a plan, give some the tracker, and we're set, I think. Operate the confessional door, use the snake rod. Funny how this, uh. replaceable parts, was it? Interchangeable parts. The snake rod. You would think that any sort of large stick would work. Okay, from here, we need to head to door 4. Door 4 actually will have the uh, FBI book with the records and the Rada Drum symbols for each member of the Getty tribe. The way to the center, quickest way, is to get to one of the, one of the uh, little hallways, and that's doorway 5 is the closest one you want to summon. Dr. John, so summon Brother Eagle. So the quickest way to get around without getting caught is to go to the upper left to room 11. Then zoom your way to room 2, grab the keys. You do not have to use the key on anything else besides Grace's room. Even though you get points for getting the animal room, and the face room. Okay, we need to head to door 7. Door 7 is a supply room. And that has the boar mask, the wolf mask, and the ceremonial robes. Which you will need to finish the game, unfortunately. Okay, key card on door 8, which means we find Gracie. I thought I saw you duck in here. Okay, talisman on Grace, and then get Mosley set up. Well, I guess the rest is just history. I mean, there's really nothing else, just click as quickly as you can. And I do get the good ending because it's actually much faster to get the good ending than it is to get the bad one. Because you have to wait to get the bad one or change your, uh, change your icon from a hand to a knife. Well, nothing to do except to wait for this thing to be over. <laughs> 